Welcome to a presentation of the Deep Rock Automatic Rod Handling System. It's featured on the DR150 drill rig from Deep Rock Manufacturing. This revolutionary system has been developed over a period of years as a result of requests from the drilling community for a safe, efficient mechanical system for handling drill rods. There are two essential components to this rod handling system. The obvious one is the new guy, Otto, the automatic rod loader. But just as important is the famous Deep Rock automatic breakout system which has been in service for over 20 years. The purpose of the automatic breakout system is to eliminate wrenches and manpower while making and breaking drill rods. Here's how it works. The drill rods have two important features. They have upset tool joints, which is to say the threaded connectors on each end are larger in diameter than the long section of pipe in the middle. The other feature is a pair of ribs or fins or lugs welded at the female end of the drill rod. When the rod is placed in our special bowl and slip assembly, it cannot fall through because the upset tool joint is larger than the opening in the bowl. Furthermore, it cannot rotate very far because the welded lugs strike against blocks inside the bowl and slips. The rods are free to move up and down, however, so to thread into and out of a drill rod, the bowl and slip, no wrench or clamp is needed. The biggest problem to overcome was how to disconnect one drill rod from another drill rod. Solving this problem was key to the success of the Deep Rock Automatic Breakout System. When the top head is loosely connected to a drill rod, if you rotate the top head, the drill rod will probably not turn. It most certainly will not unthread from the drill rod below it. However, with our system, a special barrel is lowered with a small hydraulic cylinder over the loosely connected drill rod and it drives against the welded lugs and forces the drill rod to turn with the top head whether it is firmly attached or not. That means if you rotate the top drill rod while holding the bottom rod in the bowl and slips, the two rods will unscrew from each other. There are absolutely no wrenches or clamps involved. For years and years, this was the extent of the Deep Rock system, and it was much faster and safer than almost anything on the market. Nevertheless, we felt we could improve it by adding a mechanical system to move the drill rods from the storage rack to the top head and then back again. Thus was born Otto, the automatic rod loader. This mechanical arm swings down and picks up a drill rod, stands it up, and moves it over and under the drill head. All this is done with one joystick. Furthermore, the joystick is detent so the operator only pushes it to the extreme position and the smart hydraulic system takes the arm through the various movements. In other words, the operator simply starts the ball rolling and Otto does the rest. The driller can even return to drilling while Otto goes to fetch a new drill rod. There are no critical positioning controls. Simply move Otto as far as possible during each movement and he will be right where he needs to be. It does not require hands-on babying or jockeying or nudging to get things lined up. When Otto reaches an endpoint, he is where he needs to be. A driller could operate Otto almost without looking. Otto has three stacks of drill rods for a total of 300 feet. After using all the rods in one stack, the operator merely flips a stop plate up, which tells Otto to take rods from the next stack. It's simple. It's incredibly easy to operate, and it's very cost-effective. Take particular note of the number of people involved with this operation, and you'll see a total of one. That's right. For the first time, it is truly possible for one man to effectively operate a drill rig that does not cost a fortune. Contact a sales engineer at Deep Rock to get full details on our new rod handling system featuring Otto, the automatic rod loader and see if Otto may be just the breakthrough your drilling operation needs. <laughs>